Hey everybody, it's Michelle with Schmoopy TV, and today we are playing Red Dead Redemption 2. We are on episode 5. Let's go ahead. Okay, bring Pearson animals to supply the camp. Okay. So we need to obviously hunt. I'm not going to worry about our clothes or anything like that. And, uh, but I think what we're going to do now is just go on another mission. Go around and talk to everybody first. Hey, Arthur, what you want? Oh, man, you one sour son of a bitch, ain't you? <laughs> Only when I see you. <laughs> Only when I see you. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a little kid? Oh, that's cute. Hi, Uncle Arthur. Is that little Johnny? Abigail, maybe? Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, folks is wondering what's happened to you. Nothing, Miss Grimshaw. Nothing is right! That's the point! That's the point! Work, Mr. Morgan. Folk need feeding. I never took you for the lazy type. Okay. Let's go to our donation box and hand over some things. Okay, let's contribute. Now, what to contribute? I'm not sure. But let's give... Let's see what items we have first. Okay, we have the pin. Clamp buckle, platinum engraved buckle, silver ring. Okay, how much? Uh, we'll give this. We'll give one of each of these. Okay. And then... So we've donated $21. I'm going to write that down so we know how much we've donated so far. I don't know how much we're supposed to donate every day, but I think that's a good start. Now, is this Dutch? No, no that's not Dutch. Um, here he is. Isn't it good to be out of that goddamn snow? Why are you so chipper? We're gonna be good. We are gonna be great. Faith, my son. Hey. Okay, let's go get our horse. I need to know uh, what button is our health and all of that stuff. Oh yeah, go hunting. Yeah, let's do that. Jose, you want to go hunting? Yes, what are I you do. Hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God, but you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now. Unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big loudmouth bastard tried to rob me. Was out riding, so I. Well, you know how it is. I see. 
Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. Okay, hold on one second. Well, I guess you're right. All right, here we go. Let's get this off, boy. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. He's not that bad. All the time. Ah, sorry, boy. There, boy. Okay, so he's faster. Heavy handling. I wonder what that means. Okay, let's get on. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. Where'd he go? There he is. <laughs> God, I got nervous. I was like, I've already lost him. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some this is now your main saddle. horse. Oh, okay. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like... Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Just feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. There, okay, boy. Yeah, good boy. Stables are just up ahead. Go sell that big brute and buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going out to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Me oh, I didn't know he had spots on him. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. I thought well, you're back. in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. What about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No, no papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But, your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look.
Okay, sell or stable the horse. Stabling your horse allows you to... Dang it. I didn't read it fast enough. It's only $65. Oh, this horse is free. Oh, you get to name them? Well, what should we name them? Um, we'll just name our first horse after our channel. And then we'll come up with uh, better names as we go. I just can't think of anything off the top of my head right now. What did I click? All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope oh, so. Oh, did I hit... Well, I don't sell anything other I hit than good I animals. Hit R2. Dang it. You have my word on that. <laughs> Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Looks like a nice animal you got there. You happy? Guess we'll see. Oh, we gotta lead right, it out. There, let's go. Okay, I got it. Are you gonna mount that new horse of yours or not? All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Okay, Either let's way. go. So, what's this? Okay, we have a thoroughbred horse. We're heading for. All right, let's go. It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains. I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's cold. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. <sighs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. So pretty. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place, Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side.
Oops. I was trying to read. <laughs> I literally can't read while I'm doing this. It's so weird. Easy. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains to see about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him? So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. I'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Okay, hunt a rabbit. Where are the rabbits at? I miss it. Tailed jackrabbit. Oh, cool. Alright. We did our first hunt. Well, other than the deer, but. Good job. All right. It's getting late. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Now then, you get a set up.
Okay. So I think maybe I need to do this. Wait. Did I do it right? Yeah, uh, I think I did. Finished. Cook that rabbit then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <gasps> <gasps> Okay, so we'll cook that. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay, <laughs> after all that. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. <coughs> Morning, Arthur. You ready? No, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting a good shot in. And... If he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish <laughs> oh, packing no. this up? Fish, berries. I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I, I think this is going to be hard. Arthur. I'm nervous. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Okay, I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Okay. What's the hold up here? Okay, let's go. Girl? We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the life? Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, Maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's look by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Whoa! Look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. Okay, right there. Well, there's some paw marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. This is so uh, much fun. Let's hope it's him. I'm having so much fun playing Can this. Can you tell which way he went? Okay, so he went this way.
this way. Tracks go into those trees. I hope I have the right gun. I didn't grab a gun before we started walking. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, there's another clue right over here. So let's walk over here. fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Okay. Something else on the ground, just here. There she here. Watch your step. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's gotta be close. Let's keep going. like the trail ends. We lost him? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Uh, use bait. Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Okay, that's not the right stone, I guess. This is it, right? More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? See nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Yeah, I only have my, oh no, I only have my revolver. That's not good. You only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. And I think the bear is going to come out of nowhere. I'm nervous. What do you have here? Got your knife? Oh my gosh, I knew it. 
Easy. Now it's too close. <gasps> Yet. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be out of the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well, you coming or not? I'm gonna stick around here for a while. <laughs> Uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah! I wonder why he was so afraid of the bear. I think there's like a backstory there. So it makes uh, sense to me. All right, let's pick these. I wonder if I need to eat anything right now. Let's go to our door. Um, it doesn't really look like it. But I wonder what you use to fill up that eye. You now own multiple horses and can store up to three stables. Your previous horse has been stabled for you. Okay. Yeah, we have plenty to eat. I just don't know what exactly... Um... Oh, what's this? The um, eye thing is, so I don't know. We'll go ahead and pick some more since we're here. Why not? Did I pass it? Oh, okay. I don't know. Let's go, girl. Okay, you must increase your bond with the new horse before it's able to, to perform additional actions such as rearing. Okay. Now we have our shotgun. There's the bear, I see it. Oh, that's a train. <laughs> that's funny. I was like, oh, there's the bear. No, it's not. It's literally a train. Oh, sorry. I wonder if I need to feed my horse something right now. Let me see if I can uh, find the trail of this bear. Or if it's long gone. Seems like it's long gone, doesn't it? Okay, well, I don't know. Let's go, girl.
Oh, I know what I want to look at. The, um... Okay, he gave us something for the big game. So let's look at that. Yeah, right here. Uh, well, no, we already looked at that. But we'll look at it anyway. Yeah. Okay, so we don't need that. He gave us some sort of pamphlet, though, for a big game. So let's try to find that really quick. Oh, cover scent. A pamphlet recipe on how to cover your... Oh. Let's try that out. What do we need for that? Uh, let's zoom in. Block your scent. Uh, this recipe will block your scent. Okay. Skunk. Beaver. Muskrat. Obtain scent gland from one of these animals. Heat over fire in a cup. Store in glass bottle with secure stopper. Okay, so we'll put that up. So we need a small animal to be able to cover our own scent. And then here it is, legendary animal map. So let's check that out. All right, so we have buffalo, bear, I don't know if that's a goat or a I don't know what that is. So it looks like we have buffalo, bear, wolf, maybe reindeer, moose. Awesome. Okay. I didn't mean to hit flip. Alright, that's fun. Actually, it's already been 40 minutes. So, all right, let's go ahead and end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.